Sarah here. I hope you are well this Friday. I hope you have had a really good and productive week. The weeks just fly. I don't know about you, but it flies so fast. Today I'm sharing with you how I uh, create my content strategy. So if your content gets your head in a spin like it does for so many people, I totally get it. It can feel very overwhelming. There is a lot of moving parts and I'm a big advocate of repurposing our content. When we've spent time and energy on creating something incredible and amazing, we need to make the most of that and really repurpose and share and use that piece of content the most effectively way that we possibly can. So let me know in the comments, how are you currently sharing your content? What do you have a strategy? Do you have anything in place? Do you just wing it every day and just do it off the hoof? Let me know. So for me personally, it depends where you are in your business. So if you're in the middle of a launch or if you're launching, obviously you need to plan your content a little bit further in advance. And at the moment, you know, most of us changed our plans. Any plans that you had have changed. So our content needs to change. What we're sharing needs to change. We need to adapt. You know, we need to remember that as a coach, our business is the most adaptable business. When we consider what we put out there to be and our businesses to be like plasticine we can mold it and shape it to whatever our clients need so having that top of mind is so important so really consider what where people are at right now and what they need to what they need to know what will help them what they'll be interested in so it's always you know, coming from the mindset of what does my client need now? What do my ideal audience need help with right now? And coming from that place is so important. So for me, like I said, if you are launching or in something like that, you do need to have a content strategy in place. You do need to be guiding your ideal clients on a journey, you know, of of wanting to work with you because that's what it's all about our content is marketing so it depends what you're doing if you're launching consider what people what stage of information you need to share with people when otherwise you know really I work week by week to month really and I'll think okay I like to create my content on literally having my two eyes open and my two ears open and looking and listening to what people are talking about, what is current and then I tend to work from there. So when I see people needing help or asking questions on something, I can then create content that would be valuable information for what a majority of people are thinking and feeling right now. And then I can create content for that for the whole week from one topic. So I will always create a blog post every week. So that's one piece of content. So then from that one piece of content, you can break that up into daily social media posts. You can send that to your email list to, hey, check out my latest blog. You can connect that with Pinterest. So you can do a live stream about it. You can then share that live stream to YouTube, to your IG um, TV on Instagram. So it really is stretching one piece of content, one topic, creating that into a piece of content that is interesting and relevant to your ideal clients now, and then repurposing it in all different ways and really, 
to think outside the box, to think, hey, how can I, okay, I can create a video on this. If people are really interested in it, maybe I can create a course on this. Maybe I could create a program on this. So really having your eyes and ears open, checking your stats, creating content about what people want. If people are really interested in that and have a lot of questions, you can create more content of that. So it really is eyes and ears open and really finding out what people want and need right now in the current moment and working around that. So I hope that helps you today. Thank you for joining me. Thank you for watching this video. I'm really excited you are here and following my page. Please let me know in the comments. What do you, where, do, where are you currently focusing your content? You know, quite often people are just creating the content and then they share it on one platform and that's it. And while that is great to be, to be sharing at all, to be sharing your content, this is your worldview. And let everybody know um, and maximize the use out of that content so i hope that's helped you today thank you for joining me and i look forward to speaking to you tomorrow on my daily lives have a wonderful day and i'll speak to you soon bye